Heather Casper from the Minnesota Marine Art Museum. During this time of year, we love to watch all of nature change colors. You may notice the grasses along the highway turning a golden brown, or the maple leaves turning from yellow to orange to bright red. And I'm standing here in the Manoogian Gallery, surrounded by artworks that show these same fall colors. Because just like we love to look at the changing trees, artists love to paint them. This is a painting by Worthington Whitridge called Autumn on the Delaware. You can notice a, a group of deer surrounded by these brilliant fall colored trees. This is a painting by Georgia O'Keeffe called Lake George Autumn. And she shows us the same colors in her trees that we can see when we look right up at our bluffs here in Winona. Uh, poems, poets love to write poems about autumn too. And I have two poems that I would like to share with you today. This is a poem by James S. Tippett called Autumn Woods. I like the woods in autumn, when dry leaves hide the ground, when the trees are bare and the wind sweeps by with a lonesome rushing sound. I can rustle the leaves in autumn, and I can make a bed in the thick dry leaves that have fallen from the bare trees overhead. Here's another poem by Charlotte Zolotow that talks about two of the colors we see the most in autumn. It's called Autumn. Now the summer is grown old. The light long summer is grown old. Leaves change and the garden is gold with marigolds and zinnias tangled and bold, blazing, blazing orange and gold. Thanks for hanging out with me and listening to those poems. I hope you can sneak outside and look at some beautiful fall leaves today. Hope to see you and your grown-ups soon at the Minnesota Marine Art Museum. Bye!